All right, so the Fluville Flex. What did I do recently? Well, I broke this tank right down because I moved. So it's now in my kitchen. I've got a male and female guppy in there. The male is a Dumbo. They're actually going to be going into my pond. I'm looking forward to that. Uh, there's a rabbit snail in there. That's what all that waste on the bottom is for. That is actually algae. And I was just feeding him. He just did his push-up. I love watching these guys. There he goes. <laughs> totally looks like he's doing push-ups, but he's literally just trying to move across the tank with all that shell. Uh, I've got a Nerite in here who's putting in work and doing his thing. I might actually move him into the 20 long. I think that it's about time for him to move on to a, uh, a tank that actually needs him. There's not much algae buildup in here. And I do still have invasion of the bladder snails going on. I'm not too concerned. They're not doing any damage to my plants or anything. They're just eating algae off the glass. I got my little banana that looked like it was uh, kaput when I purchased it. And I've brought it back to life. What else going on in this tank? We've got the big male koi beta still doing his thing. Domination, ruler of the tank. He keeps everybody in check. I mean, really, I don't think he even cares that anybody else is in there. I think he, if anything, likes having company every now and then because he doesn't chase. I will be taking the female guppy out before she uh, has her first spawn. But uh, anyways, I'll show you what's going on otherwise in here. Got some duckweed floating on the surface. The male Dumbo. Oh, he's right there. I was looking for him earlier and I couldn't find him. I thought he was maybe inside the... Uh, inside there but no he's up here and the female she's probably not far behind yeah there she is cruising through so this tank's doing great it's pretty low maintenance fluville makes a great product there's my assassin snail back there in the corner i don't think you can see it though because it's so dark right now on this camera but he's he's trying to keep the bladder control bladder snails under control and you know he's doing his best but man as I say that, see if I can get this to focus. There's a group of eggs right there. <laughs> so here I am saying he's doing a good job because I'm finding a lot of shells everywhere. But I also just found an egg cluster. So it's not so much a, an ever losing battle. I might actually take all the fish out of this tank at one point and throw in a pea puffer. And just let him demolish everything into this tank and then move him into his own setup, which will probably be a nano tank that would be just for him. And I could just keep breeding these snails to feed to him as well. It'd be a free food supply. But there's the tank. It's doing well. I got some plants coming in the mail this week that I can put in there to add with the sword and guppy grass and banana that are in there currently. I'd love for this tank to fill out some more around the back, but that'll be for another day. Anyways, I hope you guys are all doing well, and I'll catch you all soon.